The road show this morning in the buzz. We're talking shopping strategy. <clears throat> this will be your now, segment. Take it away. Take it away. But the question See is. See in four minutes. <laughs> Crank her up and let her go. <laughs> Do you get up before the sun on Black Friday or maybe head straight to retailers' online stores? Whatever the plan, one thing is not up for debate. There are going to be some great deals to be found on Black Friday if you have the patience to find them. Now, some shoppers in other states have actually lined up days in advance at Best Buy. Remember those people who, who um, started camping out? We talked about four days ago. Nine started, days in yeah. out oh there. Oh, my gosh. They were trying to snag some laptops for disadvantaged students. So there was a good reason behind it. But still, man, a lot of dedication there. Take a look. This is our living room. We have our two camping chairs. We have our refrigerator with all of our healthy food. So this really does give us four days to be kind of trapped together and really have that quality downtime together. And so it's, it's more than just standing in line. It's, you know, being together as a family and doing something good for someone else. And they also, they called this urban camping. I don't know if you heard that, but pretty funny. Um, do you guys go out on, on Black Friday? Uh, I, I don't just because I, I don't even... I just forget about it, to be honest. Well, you know, I'm a football guy, and I'm sure Pat is, is leftovers. Sacrilege. sacrilege. Uh, you know, the thing I don't have that many gifts to buy for no. people. And I'm going to say this, and yeah. I'm going to stop talking, because this is all about you, and it really is. But today, it, Black Friday, what's the date of Black Friday? It'll be, what, the 25th? 26th. 26th. That mm -hmm. means I'll have almost a month to shop for yes, Christmas. Yes, yes. Yeah. There's plenty of so time. I don't need to do it in one day. No, the reason that Take people, it away. The reason that people will want to do this is because sometimes you you can get like a free a free camera. I've gotten yeah. free uh, shredders, you know, crazy, crazy things that they want, you know, to get people in through the door. Um, Rent Them Outlets is actually owned by the same company that owns Woodbury Commons, which is my personal favorite uh, <laughs> premium outlet shopping centers. <laughs> um, but in any case, last, last uh, Black Friday, I was in New York with some friends. And uh, the Woodbury Commons outlets had a system where you would park at a state park. There would be there was free coffee, free hot chocolate. And they shuttled everybody over. It shuttled everybody over. You got to so bypass organized. all the lines. You got oh, dropped nice. off. If you shopped too much and you shopped, you know, and you needed to bring stuff back to your car, you could get back on the bus, bring it, and there was a police detail circling the parking oh, lot. Goodness. It was so That's well crazy. planned that it was such a Isn't pleasure. Isn't the economy struggling right now? It doesn't you know, sound like can it. Can I tell you there were when, when uh, it was amazing because you could you saw Japanese people flying over from Tokyo yeah, yeah. with empty suitcases stocking up on Fendi and Gucci and Coach yeah. and that sort of thing. I like it because I can pick up a couple of things for me. I can I, I don't I'm not organized enough to like say, okay, I hear I'm gonna yeah. go get everything for everyone and be done in one day. See that's why I'm not I don't go crazy with Black Friday and it's only because yeah, my mom, my dad, my sister that's that's pretty much it. I can cover that pretty pretty easily on New, uh, Christmas Eve, which I usually do. I have yeah. I have been found that I've you know I've done the, the Christmas Eve thing where you're scrambling sure. to do it. It's more fun. But what I, I it is do a lot like fun. That. I do like do you think can I tell you? We thrive under pressure the, in this yeah. business, right? Yeah. Like, yeah. yeah. The thing yeah. about going Christmas Eve shopping on Christmas Eve that I love is it's the one time of the year that everyone's as frenzied about shopping as I am perpetually. <laughs> um, what I actually do is I shop a lot online and I'll copy links into my um, Which Outlook is also huge calendar. for Black Friday, right? Yeah, exactly. Let know online. And if you get, you know, if you get signed up online, you'll, they'll send you um, a lot of coupons and discount deals. You can go to retailmenot.com and get coupon codes. Sometimes they'll email you a little wow, coupon. you are on a <laughs> roll right now. This is awesome. <laughs> Oh my God! They just canceled two more segments. I got like twenty minutes. I got to go. But uh, but yeah, it's really exciting, and, and I like to I like to keep track of it, you know, throughout the year, so that you have an idea of what to get. One everybody thing right, I, I would do, and again, uh, um, this it's just it's just not my thing, but I would maybe one year if I'm in the the market for a, a new TV or something like yeah. that where they have these huge discounts. It may actually be fun to get a tent and just if you get some of your buddies and, and do that right. once. I would experience. do it once. It would not like be yeah. tradition. Yeah. Like yeah. Driving cross country. Yeah. Or, or like, like, you know, guys do that for playoff yeah. tickets. They yeah. Yeah. I sure. may do that maybe once if I can get some of my buddies I'll to do I'll be honest. It I've only go done the Black Friday something. thing, you know, super, super the overnight early. Just a, no, not, not overnight, but super, super early just a couple of times. And it was. It was a group yeah. of friends. And it's always for the experience <laughs> and for the as coffee. As much as you love shopping, yeah. could you imagine her in a tent? On cement. No. <laughs> no I don't think no. that's going to happen. Again, gonna happen. again, one of my favorite quotes, I love not camping. <laughs> <laughs> um, but, Courtney, I, I want to throw it over to you because uh, I'm interested to hear what some of our viewers are saying about their strategy, where they go, how they do it, how they plan. Look how focused she is. I love this. She, she's focus. ready to go. She's got her sneakers uh, behind the couch there. Our viewers either love it or hate it, but I'm finding most people are actually going to head out and brave the crowds. And our producer, Ashley, is one of them. She's on the live blog and says, call me crazy, but I can't wait to go Black Friday shopping. And Joe Butera says, I do plan on shopping on Black Friday. I have my 
stores picked out and my game plan mapped out. She said, he said, I'm as ready as old St. Nick himself. We have a poll right underneath the live blog. Do you plan to go shopping on Black Friday? A, yes, but in stores only. B, yes, but online only. Yes, both in stores and online. Or D, no, I don't plan to shop that day. And our friends on Facebook are, are weighing in. Lots of people are saying no way. But Erin um, Scorpio says she won't even go to a convenience store. She said she did it one year for a family member and was appalled to see how people were acting. Patricia Fargley says, no, I worked retail and I know all about the buys and how many items the store really had. She said, to me, it is not worth it. And Tina Chochula says, I've worked retail for many years and still go out on Black Friday. She says her mom and her have done it for years, and now she'll go out with her daughter, and she says it's a great time to shop and then breakfast before I go to work. And I've heard that a lot. A lot of folks are shopping and then eating breakfast and starting their day. So that sounds like a fun little event to uh, kick off the Christmas shopping. But for, uh, for now, we're going to head into the kitchen. I'll be back in about a half hour with those polling.